If we look at the highest priorities that we could have as a society, the environment should be number one. California is facing really catastrophic effects on our environment. We've seen temperatures increasing and wildfires increasing steadily each year. Every year we have these megafires, and every year we spend $20 billion to try to manage it. At the same time, we are spending almost nothing producing solutions. The situation is urgent. Ideally, we should have been acting already, but we can't go back in time. What we have is now. California has enormous intellectual resources at its universities, and a very willing and committed population to solve a problem. But what it really needs is a comprehensive institute that can bring together both the best science with individuals and expertise that can actually affect change in the state. We need an authoritative voice around the solutions that are backed up by science that can be used effectively by the policy community and by the private sector. And that's fundamentally what the Climate Wildfire Institute was created to do. CWI at UCLA is going to be a research institute focused on climate and wildfire to understand, predict, train students, inform policy, and develop resilience. We're in the second largest city in the United States. Very diverse city, very diverse economically. And we know that the lowest income folks in our society often bear the largest costs of climate change. This gives us an opportunity to understand how we can deal with issues in an equitable way. We're a public institution. Serving California is part of our DNA. This is our mission, number one. Number two, we have the expertise. At UCLA, we have the investment in the intellectual infrastructure that is going to be needed to address many of these issues. We are one of the institutions where climate prediction really was born, and we have organizations like the Institute of Environment and Sustainability. The IOS has been in existence for 25 years, looking at problems from across the spectrum of science. UCLA has a long-standing record of fostering interdisciplinary research. We have a record of collaboration. We have a whole host of scholars and researchers who are already working on science that's related to climate and wildfire. This is a unique opportunity to leverage UCLA's educational programs to train the next generation of leaders to transform our broken relationship with wildfire. So if we look at what we have today and what we could have with a small graded investment, we could really do something transformative. We appreciate state support, providing initial funding to get us started. But it's often that philanthropic support that really leads to dazzling results. And often it's the differentiator in a research effort. We're not just doing research for the moment. We're doing research for the future. We're at a critical point where we have to make changes or you get to a point where you really can't recover. This is an urgent problem that requires immediate solutions, we can't wait.